Hydrologic Outlook National Weather Service Pendleton or 6.09 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time Friday, November 4th, 2022. Heavy rain through Saturday will create rising rivers and streams with a chance of debris flows from recent wildfire burn scars. An atmospheric river will produce moderate to heavy precipitation across portions of northeast Oregon and southeast Washington through early Saturday morning. Snow is gradually transitioning to rain in the northern Blue Mountains. Steady moderate to heavy rain today and tonight will keep the ground saturated. Total liquid precipitation amounts through 11 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time tonight ranging from 0.5 to 1.25 inches are expected along the foothills. Total amounts ranging from 1.50 to 3.5 inches are expected in the mountains with locally heavy amounts nearing 4 inches. This will lead to rises on area rivers and streams with nuisance to minor flooding possible, especially along Mill Creek in Umatilla and Walla Walla counties. Debris flows from the recent fires such as Elbow Creek and Green Ridge fires are possible in the steep terrain. Ponding of water in low-lying areas and in areas of poor drainage can be expected. Please monitor the latest river forecast from the National Weather Service for additional information. Hydrologic Outlook National Weather Service Pendleton or 10.02 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time Friday, November 4, 2022. Heavy rainfall through Saturday will cause rising stages along the Yakima River. An atmospheric river will produce moderate to heavy precipitation across the east slopes of the Washington Cascades through early Saturday morning. Total liquid precipitation amounts through 11 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time tonight ranging from 0.5 to 1.25 inches are expected along the foothills. Total amounts ranging from 1.50 to 3.5 inches are expected in the mountains with locally heavy amounts nearing 4 inches. This will lead to rises on rivers with the Yakima at Easton expected to crest at action stage around 50.5 to 51.0 feet. This will cause areas of minor flooding to be possible along the already saturated region. Please monitor the latest river forecast from the National Weather Service for additional information.